Good afternoon to all, especially to the future senior high school students of the University of San Agustin, Baron and Garchin. So what is STEM at the University of San Agustin? And what is STEM in the spirit of UNITAS, VERITAS, and CARITAS? Since the University of San Agustin is a research-centered institution, the science, technology, engineering, and mathematics strand or the STEM strand is giving emphasis to the core value, the veritas or the truth. This is where students search for truth through research, laboratory investigations and reports. With this, the students are trained to be critical thinkers, to filter information and to love the truth and to stand for it. Activities in the senior high school are also anchored on the other two core values, which are the UNITAS for unity and CARITAS or charity. The department prepares activities for students to develop them holistically, such as the Science Day under the Scienza Circuli and Math Day organized by our math club. These activities are held every school year, and this is a great venue for learning science and math, which will teach students not just to have fun, but also to appreciate more the science and math theories and concepts, not just inside the classroom, but also apply them practically. The students are not just taught uh, of the things that they should know, but also they are guided on the choices and decisions they make, especially on their future careers. Work immersion is a very good venue for this, with the guidance of their immersion teachers and in collaboration also with the subject teachers, they are sent off to their specific field of choice for their careers, like for those who are in the medical track. The USA Senior High School STEM strand collaborated with the DOH province to assign students to work with different hospitals and community health centers. Same as true with the students in the engineering track. The department tapped alumnus of the university's College of Technology to help us in guiding students on their chosen field. Teachers at the STEM strand, led by its coordinator and licensed professionals, are trained according to respective disciplines. Some master's degree holders and most are undertaking master's education. Teachers just like you students are lifelong learners who have a growth mentality and natural curiosity about the world. The sudden shift to this online or blended learning due to this pandemic did not hinder the teachers and the department in general to promote holistic higher level thinking related to curriculum frameworks and standards. Shifting strategies and the adaptive learning methodology were employed, especially on the subjects that are unique to the STEM discipline. Among these specialized subjects are pre-calculus, basic calculus, general biology one and two, general physics one and two, general chemistry one and two, STEM work immersion and practical research. As presented in the previous slides, you will not just learn concepts, you will explore them. And you will not just explore them in the walls of the classrooms and laboratories, virtual or real, but you will apply them outside those walls through engaging team activities promoted during Mathematics Day and Sci Olympics or Science Olympics. These specialized subjects are tailored with exploratory activities, like ones performed in the laboratories, 
which in the plan for the possible face-to-face -face limited class will be performed hands-on. Each STEM field has a wide range of specialties. Now, students, if you are interested in science, you can pursue studies in biology and in chemistry, biotechnology, environmental science, and many others. While well, those who are interested in mathematics and allied sciences, um, you can pursue programs in electrical engineering and mechanical engineering, aeronautics, civil engineering, computer science, information systems, and many others too. The question is, does the senior high school STEM strand indeed help its students realize their potential in the career path? Well, few among the thousands had spoken. And I would like to share a few lines with you from, the co from what they have said. Ayn said, and I quote, since I was a child, I was bent on taking medical technology and proceeding to medicine. However, taking up a variety of subjects during my senior high school years at the University of San Agustin broadened my thinking and helped me understand more about the world because of the subjects I took. My perspectives had changed. Now, I is currently taking BS AMT, that's Aircraft Maintenance Technology, a course um, relevant to what he really wanted, and that is to being a pilot. Also, Trisha um, shared, said, and I quote, my senior high school journey was a great factor in my decision to pursue nursing in college, mainly because the STEM strand introduced me to a lot of topics that ignited my interest in pursuing a course that is centered around science. It also made me appreciate further the different fields of science, which cemented my decision to choose nursing as a college course. Furthermore, Mark Jirik also shared and said, and I will quote, um, as an alumnus of the USA SHS STEM, there are lots of factors that influence and help me realize the course or career path that I will pursue in college. Um, these factors are um, subjects that are being taught by the university, especially the practical research, which enlightened me to acknowledge both my strengths and weaknesses in a lot of aspects. Second factor is the work immersion, which gave me an opportunity to have a glimpse of the future that I want to pursue. Without these factors and experiences, I really doubt I could pursue the career path or course that I am pursuing right now. Lizette added, and I will quote, the university senior high school program has sufficiently instrumented our learning through quality laboratories and allowed us to explore science and all the basic branches that stem from it. Moreover, the university has opened our eyes to the country's still inefficient healthcare, which drove me to direct my efforts and future learnings to elevate these healthcare inequalities. Okay, by the way, right now, Mark Jirik is pursuing BS Petroleum Engineering and Lizette is um, pursuing BS um, Basic Human Studies. We also have a few more individuals to name. Robert said, and I quote, prior to senior high school, I was undecided on my career choice. Luckily for me, the time I spent during those years helped me recognize my strength and made me who I am today. It was in my general biology subject that I really fell in love with human anatomy. We were taught concepts um, beyond the book and the recommended curriculum. It was my passionate mentors that helped me decide to choose nursing as a walk of life. Also, Joshua, who is as well pursuing BS nursing, said, and I quote, 
in research and immersion, we were given a heads up and we drew guidance and assistance from, from our teachers to focus on something related to our courses in the future. So as early as that time, we could put our hearts into the areas. We were also rigorous in our science subjects as for sure, these are prerequisite concepts in the said courses. We were provided with different activities and opportunities to further develop our knowledge and to deepen our understanding of the courses that we will be choosing. Okay. Last but not the least, Jessica and John Marlowe also shared, said, and I quote, Jessica said, studying in the institution enabled me to hold my skills, not just in academics, but also in the skills that I utilized in my daily life as a student. I've learned that with one heart and one, one mind, we could excel in our own little ways. John Marlowe said, and I quote, the experiences like having complex lessons and discourses conducted by well-rounded teachers, building friendships with diverse personalities, external activities such as mural painting and joining USA publications and instilling the values of the school have assisted me in choosing my college course right now. Jessica is pursuing BS nursing and John Marlowe is pursuing BS architectural drafting. There are lots, there are, there are thousands of them, okay? Um, lastly, I would like to leave you with St. Augustine's quote, and that's go forth on your path as it exists only through walking. Students, viewers, walk with us, join us, join our senior high school STEM family.